Speaking of you, you mentioned Star Wars Trilogy. I love your Mando episodes. This is your first chance you're getting to build a universe. It's not yeah. the Star Wars universe, but it has a lot of those elements. What was your favorite part of designing and figuring out the universe? Was it the ships? Was it the creatures? What was it kind of your favorite part of that? I have to tell you, it was really all of it because <clears throat> we had to, you weren't just creating one planet. You were creating what Janet describes as worlds within worlds, like this vast subatomic world. So part of it was we have to fill that world with different types of creatures and beings and, and even sort of humanoid characters and talk about sort of the, the political structure of it and, and like there's oppression down there, there's a war going on. So we were able to sort of take a lot of different aesthetics, you know, like the Zolom character, a freedom fighter, he, there's a steampunk vibe to him. Yeah. And then Veb feels like a photoreal version of Gleep and Gloop from the Herculoids or something. It's like, uh, you know, and there's some Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy-esque concepts like, Let's take all of these things because they're going to make sense in this context because we're telling a story about all these different types of life down there who have come under the thumb of Kang the Conqueror. Yeah. I'm sorry, Cassie.